what's up YouTube this is Manchun Tapotal and in this video I'm going to show you the number update in my Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge so here let me show you that quickly my software information and here I have my this logout official logout in my Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge and it's really amazing I know this is the latest update and I am updating it after one month but I don't know why I have not updated but I really enjoying updating this because I am getting this new notification option which I am getting in my Moto G4 Plus and I have to just slide down like this and I can left right and now it comes up with various new features like here I have this performance mode so after this the increasing brightness 10% and the screen resolution will be like WQHD so and we have also this blue light filter to not affect the eyes and uh, we have this always on display and these are the features and if you want to access your brightness you can also set it if you want it to top so it will not show from here you have to slide it from here if you want it top you can just click on the show control on top and you will also get this blurry feature in the background here you can see that whenever I am opening apps I am getting this blurry feature in the background and it is really amazing and we also have this new game launcher and it is really looking very clean, sharp, nice and the apps are running really smoother here you can see everything is running just clearly fine, smooth, no lag and even in the settings also now we have these icons and uh, all the options adjusted the connection, sound and vibration, notification, display the advanced features like games, quick launch camera and various other features available here and in advance you also have this advanced enhancer to increase the image quality in the video we also have this device maintenance like battery performance mode storage ram and here you can see that i am having around uh, let's check it so after cleaning this i am here lots of apps are running in the background and i'm not getting any lag so file size is around 1.2 gb of update so here you can see that around almost 562 MB reserved. Sorry for this line, it is a bug and maybe it is a hardware problem. I will soon replace my Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge on the service center. Uh, I am really sure that it is in 100 right now. So here you can see that I have updated all my apps with the latest update. So let's check whether the new, any other update is coming in this or not. So here we have the different software update option. Here you can see that I have uh, less chart is so here you can see that the latest update has already been installed. It is just super smooth. I am not getting any lag. And here we have all the different options. And we will also get this blur background feature after the Nobat update. Look, apps are running really fast. I am really impressed. I have did a separate into two benchmark test in the Geekbench and I am really getting a good score as compared to the previous Nougat. So I am really happy after updating my device. So let's see whether the Samsung will update it to the Android 8.0 or not. So that's a quick review with our Samsung Galaxy S7 Edge. I hope you really enjoyed this video and if you did a like will be appreciated and for more videos like this you can subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below as always as in the next video thank you peace out